Hello, part two of this. Um, there's been a days between you watching this, but for me, it's the same day. It is the same day. And I haven't sorted my doodah thing out, which is what I should have done. Oh, because that's what it's doing. Right, let us sort this out. Right. Oh, I need to, I'll set that in a minute. No point setting it just now when I've got to, um, do the putty. Give it a good old warm up. Flatten it. And I'm not going to take the other stuff out. I'm just going to I don't know, I think I might get away without doing that, to be honest. Let's just try it. Start the hour. Well, not too bad. What else I can talk about now because I've already kind of like talked about it. So it's that one in the middle. Oh dear. Oh. Oh, now it's that one at the top. Don't use. Oh, too late. All right. I'm trying to think. Get on there. Try and get my natural oils all over it. any Korean dramas for ages. I don't quite know what's going on. Didn't last long, did it? watching a few more again oh, for god's sakes back to the watchmakers and the magic lick look at that not wrong with the magic lick is it starting to get a little bit stickier Magic lick. I think the lick it is, and well, ugh, it tastes very nice. Oh, but look how wonky they are.
I could do with one of those dabbers actually. I might have to get one just to try it out. I think that could be quite interesting just until it gets, you know. You know, like the old um, post office people use. I know I could just use a sponge, but it's not quite the same, is it? I don't think it holds the water the same. Yeah, I'm fed up now. Getting annoyed. I've got a horrible taste in my mouth and I don't know whether it's the fake aspartamine from the watermelon or whether it's the um, the glue dot. Oh, a mixture of both. Oh, God. Not something. I've got a screw and light bulb and I've got a... It goes dim every now and then. Then I have to unscrew it and unscrew it back in again and it works. It's got a loose connection somewhere. But I can't be bothered to take it apart. Because, well, I just can't be bothered. Ah, ria, ria, ria. Let's just try picking up two at a time. Oh. That's all right. Two at a time. From a ten placer. But at least you can set two right, can't you? You're not going to lose formation halfway through. beef in. I've got a bit of beef that I need to cook up. It was supposed to be for yesterday but um, I didn't get around to doing it yesterday because I was too busy tidying up and then I just didn't have the energy. Yeah, occasionally I will cook a bit of beef up. That one's I got on special so it was four pounds. Would have been about eight, nine pound I think it was. And it's quite a big piece. So I'm gonna I've got roast beef sandwiches. I can do it into a casserole. I can stir fry it. So they are some parts of the menu that I'm doing with it. It's going to take 20 minutes per pound and 20 minutes extra like tea one for the pot 20 minutes for the pot
Ow, this is where it's happening, isn't it? Oh, God. Yeah, let's just get a bit of them. A little bit of fresh. Oh, are we on? Are we able to see? Yeah. Abby's patty and it, this one was watermelon and lemonade. There's always one part of the flipping pen. You can have puttied up to the eyeballs and yet it won't. This month I can do my tax return. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Get that over and done with. fun when you end up with this when you end up with putty and glue dots that just fight you oh dear Starting to get squarey. Uh, just step away from the drills, walk away from the drills, go and do something else. But I can't because it's given myself. Cross around my neck. Oh, bloody hell. Actually, because these um, places come from China, I think I keep licking a part of that and that's perhaps not good because it's probably full of cadmium or some other dangerous metal part that it's come from probably turn these tips are turned from made from um computer parts or something oh for f breathe and breathe Ow, ow, ow. I drink very hot tea, burn your tongue, 
And let's just add more to the mayhem. I have put one on. Oh, God. Oh, look at that. I picked up one. So now I'm picking them up instead of putting them down. I'm having a right old field day, aren't I, here? Don't drop. Uh. Right, how brief. Where's the way over? I've got two other pens. Granted, this one is my fave, but I have two other pens and I do not know. where they are well i do they're over that way but over that way is yeah is like the matterhorn everest is in that corner annapurna is that way no that way mont blanc over there yeah driving me berserk. I thought what I'm going to do. I'm going to put it in the fridge for a bit. That usually calms it down. Oh, right. Let's get this one out. But sadly, we have to go for a bit of waxu. Oh, and I've got a doodah thing on the other end of that. Yeah, in there. Ah. Oh, God, get out. There we go. Go for the plastic this time. Maybe to take the plastic off. Remember the first time I used them. Oh, yes, that was interesting. Why isn't this wax? God, yeah, now no, why this wax is going to last forever? Because you can't get out in it. I used to say. Right. Oh God, these pens are so thin after what I'm used to. Oh my God. And they're so light. Oh my God. Oh, I don't know. Oh God, I can't get used to it. I've got one of these. But can I get it on? Pardon the expression. It's going on. Oh, it did go on. Sometimes you have trouble getting those squishies on. All right, let's see. Oh, I can't get used to the thinness of this thing. Oh, hold on a minute. Hold on a cotton pick a minute. Why am I faff arsing around? There it is. Here's one I made earlier. Right, let us go again. Yeah, that was good. It's not staying in. <laughs> Get in and stay in. Well, it either works or it doesn't. And if it doesn't, then I'll go back to the other one. Oh, it's very, um, what's the word? Wibbly wobbly. Oh, and look how much wax came off. But by Jove, I think we're doing it. Oh, and that works a little bit better as well. I think I've 
and a, a round multi-facer tool. I'll just dump all those in. All right. Oh, yes. We're going back to basics. Right, where are we now on the old great scheme of things? 40 minutes over, 20 minutes down, and I've done egg or all. Right, now's the time to catch up. It's a bit hard because these are now, I'm trying to remember and get used to wax again. And it is slightly wider, the, um, the thing, so I'm trying to fit it in. This is a pen I made with some of that foam plasticine or whatever it is called, clay or what, I don't know. Fimo, whatever, air dry stuff. It's one of those midnight or whatever, past midnight, three o'clock, four o'clock morning orders. And I don't know why I ordered it. I had a job in mind for it. And then I can't remember. And then I thought, oh, well, I can use it actually to, to go with, because this does kind of go with this painting to do it to test it out on and that I've got one of my um, other pens you know similar to um, my posh pen wherever that's now gone I don't know where it's gone now oh great but anyway I've got it for one of those posh pens which I think I got it for the red one. I was going to do um, put it around the red one to make it a little bit softer because I like the chunk and it wasn't so weighty and I wanted to try and make it a bit more heavier but I don't think it's going to do that but it will it certainly will do something it'll give it a cushion because I'm starting to get there. You can see it, a little bulge from where I hold my pen. So I thought having something soft might work. And I, what else do I think I'd get it for? I can't remember, there was another thing. I think it was to make shoes for pipe cleaner people or something like that. I can't remember. And let's face it, it's always nice to have weird and wonderful new things in your stash to try. If not, then, you know, at a later date when you think, oh, yes, what can I use for that? And I go, oh, yeah, I could try that. Oh, look at that. A nice bit of um, oh. Not as fond of rounds. Could you 
can see all the crap in between. And that's where the putty got. Putty just seems to want to stick to the canvas. You can't ever get it off. after this hour I will stop but I will continue off cam and I'll keep going until I finish the painting because and I'll come back in and you know a little bit later on and do another stint hopefully when I'm near to finishing I'll be changing colours in a minute. I'll go to L's next and then I'll do the big I'm just trying to think this way is taking a lot longer so um I'm just trying to think what else to say I don't know silence is golden oh god golly nonsense that is the problem I'm finding so if there's a round sort of up nearby I can't get the um the thing in because the other drills sort of push it away and then when you place it because you've sort of committed yourself to placing at that point and then it just goes all wonky. Right. Let us see. I'm nearly done with this colour on this bit, on her hat. I think it's a hat. Right. Again. It's not very neat, but then you know, hats of creases. Oh, oh, yeah. I'd like one of these, but with a clear lid so you can see when you're putting it in a way and you know that it's all gone in. Right, now what are we on? We're on L's, aren't we? L. L of a painting, this. Thirty-one minutes. Oh. 
Alors, c'est Done it again. Yeah, it's trying to get used to because it's got more give, more bends. from the past that's sure God. remember when these are the only pens I had I didn't think oh don't need a, don't need to buy out one but oh my god first time I went for the metal tips in these and I went oh my god that is nice and then I went then I said right treat myself I had one to start off with and it broke that much use and then I realized that I had to pay out a little bit more on my blue one that I tend to usually use it was about I don't know 12 quid off Amazon but it did come with all the uh, meta um you know adapters Noisy, but oh, it's nice and breezy. Oh, I need to put that meat in. Ah, that's where that one went. Oh, look, two fours have come out. Bloody typical. Huh. It's so frustrating. pink ones Ooh. I'm ready for bed I've got two boxes over there that I want to get off of that dump bin and those two boxes I've got to sort out and then repack them with things that perhaps I'm not going to use for a while but I still want to keep and then I'm going to put them in the under the stairs because room there for some bits and then I can empty out the dump bin and then I've got a place for my walls to go and I just need to get measure it up and get a piece of wood 
that will just sit on top. So I've got a little table so I can put my, um, my, um, what's it, frames on there. My needle punching frames on there. I don't mind getting a hanging pot to go over the side where I can put my um, threaders and punches, scissors. And then I'll be able to sit on the sofa and do some needle punching. Where did that go? There. Oh! skin is so itchy today. Oh, I don't know what's going on with it. Oh. Oh. Oh, I've got a blooming thing from FedEx saying, oh, there's delay in your, um, in your parcel okay no that's my secret temple and the second that comes in i'm going to be finding a um a case i'll do a quick unboxing and then i should be kitting it up and then i shall feel calm and then and then i won't do it for another three years <laughs> oh my god I really do need to to work a way through this. I've got to do a de detox where I'm just doing a Lisette, you know, where I'm just from Lisette Crafts and Tells. Just don't allow myself to buy any more. Or I suppose I could allow myself one a year, but then it's known when that one comes. And then when I've forgotten that I bought that one that year and try and knuckle on and do as many as I can. So really I need to finish all my whips. So that's what I'm gonna focus on, my whips. Next month it'll be a, um, I'll be finishing my whips, but it'll be DIY, my cross stitch conversion whips. But then they don't matter so much because I don't mind if they go on because, you know, that be just one. I've got some rather big paintings, which is the problem. You know, go big, go large, or go home, as they say. <laughs> but I am home, <laughs> but I still went large. Oh dear. Right, let me see. Oh, there. And three. Get off, thank you. And oh, that one can be any amount. And I want a four. Oh, I hate it when it gets stuck in the thing at, at an angle. So it's partially wedged in. Oh, for God's sakes, just stop peeing around. I've had enough of flipping pens, peeing around. If you didn't want me to do this, you should have just said so. And not just caused me grief with every pen I've used. I know, I should have finished some of the other ones I've got before I started a new one. I know. But, this is me we're talking about. When do I listen? Right, let's get those other two. Oh, God. 
those other two. Um, here it come. Here it come. Those other two ones. Um, God knows where they went to. Maybe I hadn't done them in the first place. Well, that's looking all right, isn't it? Right, now, where are we on now? 20 minutes I've got. Do you think I'm going to do all those takes in 20 minutes? Well, let us see. Oh, I should have done that, really. Oh, well. Let's get this over and done with. Going the wrong way. I prefer going this way. I prefer going vertical than horizontal. That's five. I need a four. The thing is, once you've placed this or got this down so far, you can't see whether you're in the, on the right, you know, place. One, two, three, four. And that's a three, that one. Ow, knickers. Three now. So I definitely felt that twist round. Oh God, maybe in shot or out of shot. Got to remember to keep looking up at the camera and just check where they. I've done this one, I'm going to go and put that meat in. So I think it's going to take a good hour and a half. It's a lot better than fighting with flipping glue dots. Oh, still not straight though, but that's rounds for you. This is why a lot of people like squares. Because they can, you know, you can't not get them really that straight to be honest because they butt up against each other they're self-straightening unlike rounds which are self-annoying look at that i mean that's not bloody straight and if you spend all day doing this getting straight that's all you'll be ever doing and i've just got too many kits that i need to do
great. And then there's a three. And then there's my eyesight's doing its watering thing again. Oh dear, three. And then there is. Oh. <laughs> there was. I have to go that way. Right. Oh dear, this is no good. Oh dear. Well, all I can say is that pack of ginger snap biscuits have lasted me well over a week. which is incredible. Because with a tea, I can dunk the whole bucket. I prefer ginger nuts, but I can't have them. So these are the next best thing. Problem is after you eat one and want a drink of something cold but the only cold drink I've got in my fridge is that watermelon vulvic stuff and I do not like the watermelon flavour one peach and raspberry is better but I finished that one There's that one. Now that one went lying off here, didn't it, somewhere? Got 12 minutes to go. Right. What I'm going to do I'm going to at least get that done when they stick to the side of the um the pen Well, even if I don't manage to get this done in one day, I will log down the hours and I'll do it that way. Because I do have the buzz that I really should be getting on and doing some more tidying up. And while I've got that buzz on my head, I should continue it. 
but we will see. washing out. Clothes washing and the washing up. Ah, oh. oh, dear. All right. Oh, God, my eyes gone blurry. Oh, get on there. Oh, look at what's happened there. It's because I felt it hitting up against something and I couldn't get the whole thing in, in its place where I need it to be. I think I'm stuck in there. Oh, guess what I found? I found the two. So when I was putting those ones in, Those two ABs. No one does have difficulty with the um with the wax. Oh, look. <laughs> oh my god. No wonder it wouldn't pick up. For God's sakes. Okay. See so no matter what you use putty wax whatever you are still going to have problems and issues so it's which one is the lesser evil lesser of two evils Three, four minutes wasted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I've got in my head. That song, ay ay babushka babushki ay ay. Oh, we're ready. They reckon we're headed for World War Three. When you've got Putin flipping, uh, what's it called? Um, Winnie the Pooh, I think they call him. And who's the other one? remember it's not Kim Jong-un I don't think oh it's um it's like a Syrian person and you've got them you know as the allies to Syrian attack or whatever it is then well hmm. I mean Putin's got a track record is not he he was there saying oh well I don't think you and you know they shouldn't have done or whatever and it's like, well, yeah, you've got the track record, you're part of UN, and look what you've been doing to Ukraine, you little muppet. And if they win, and we're then subservient to them, I will still say muppet. Because I drive over his toes on my mobility scooter. waving my crutch at them. Get out of the way, you little muppets. Or as the Australians like to say, you mongrel, you're a bloody mongrel. <laughs> I love that. Uh, that's the worst thing that any, that you can be, can be said about you in Australia. Forget all those nasty other words. No, nope. you mongrel. That is the lowest of the low. 
and I pity the poor mongrel dogs. <sighs> the real dogs, that is, not the, the scallywag mongrels. When two tribes go to war, one is all that you can score. Working for the black stuff, when two tribes go to war, one is all that you can score. Yeah, God. Those were the days, aren't they? Frankie goes to Hollywood. Do you remember when he didn't relax? He got to number one and they couldn't show it. <laughs> And Radio 1 wouldn't play it either until, you know, for ages. And it's like, oh, come on. <sighs> Taking a loud, don't give up on us, baby. You can still come through. They can allow that crap through. Sorry, David Soul, but, you know, then, um, relax, don't do it when you want to go to it. Relax, don't do it when you want to. Yeah, that's as far as this clean living <laughs> channel will go. Well, I didn't have any dreams of Wang Ebo last night. I was blimming gutted. Well. Say, Livy. Oh dear, these are well crooked. And I think any minute now it's going to go off, isn't it? I can feel it. I can feel it in my fingers. Feel it in my bones. I'm going to look because otherwise I'm going to jump. Oh, two minutes 42. Didn't want to jump. Let's try and finish this bit. Mm. <gasps> right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All through the night. La da 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 this get me dinner on that's what I'm gonna do what am I gonna have tonight I'm gonna I'm just oh, I've got a d um d speck of those potatoes I've got some patatis and they're starting to root so I've just got to chop off the chop out the rooty bits Pick out the hardest ones, whack them in the microwave, and I will. Oh no, I can put them in the oven at the same time. So I can have baked potatoes and roast beef. And veggies. And that cat is mewing. Well, I'm pleased to that bit. Hey, 
18 seconds. Did it. Yes, I did it. Bingo. <laughs> Right, on that note, I'm going to love you and leave you, and I will see you in the next one. Tati bye. Please remember, though, if you nearly forgot, to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Thanks a lot. See you in the next one. Bye.